everybody. I guess y'all know who I am. Well, oh, that sounded weird. I guess you guys know who I am by now, so I'm not going to say my name. Okay, um, I know I haven't shown anything in a while, so I'm going to do that now. Um, this is a redo of a video that we tried to do earlier before I switched rooms, and it didn't work because of technical issues. <coughs> the mic. Um, okay, so this is the brailler that I use. And it's really heavy. That's the back. And I gotta set it down to do this. Um, this, you can raise this up to uh, put the paper in. And then when you put the paper in, you can put this down. And it holds onto the paper. Um, where is it? This is the, bro the, the thingy that rails. I don't know what it's called. Um, and then you move it back whenever you get to the end of the line and you push um, this button to move down the line. You push this button to backspace in case you mess up or whatever. Um, these, this is the space bar and these keys down here fold up. Um, this is the well, um, the typing keys, two of them on the left-hand side, yeah, and these uh, right here on the right side, well, my right, um, are also typing keys, these are the first set of typing keys, um, oh, here's all three of them down, there you go, that works, um, this is really heavy because it's like, I don't know, I guess it's made out of steel or something, I don't know. But it's really, really heavy. And really, really old. Okay, um, that was item number one. Okay, I'm back, and if you hear a sound in the background, it's just my dad mowing the grass. Okay, this is the second part, or item of the video. Um, yes, it's in a pencil case. That's how little it is. Um, this is a slate and stylus, and the slate it was not connected to the stylus with this piece of string that was done for me. Um, okay, so how does this work? Well, there is the, the little uh, keys that I showed you on the brailler, there's something like that inside of this uh, slate and I mean the slate right here, this, this is the slate. And um, it has the thingies that you write with, the six cells, we'll call them. And the only, they're opposite, like the ones that are on the left are on the right, which really confuses me. Lily, stop playing with the string, bad kitty. Um, sorry. Lily. Okay, and, um, this is great for if you want to write down phone numbers and names and addresses, etc. This is a, a, um, oh, what are they called? The, the little, um, note cards. Yes, thank you, Lacey. <laughs> these are note cards, and these go inside the slate here, um, and you want to, you don't want to write in this row because it hangs off the, like, you can barely read what's on the top, like the dots go off the top or whatever. Okay, so you want to go down to the second row, and if you'll give me a minute, I'm going to write something and then tell you what I wrote, because I'm not very good at this, because it confuses me. Okay. And you need a flat surface to do this.
Okay, so obviously this is going to suck. Oh, and also if you put it on this side, if you put it in this way, it'll barrel on this side. Okay, so now I'll tell you what I said. I, I meant to write cat, but it didn't come out cat. <laughs> it came out CD, the, the little symbol thing or contraction for EA, and then I wrote an R. Because you don't write out all the words in Braille if you're advanced in Braille. Okay, so those are my two things that I wanted to show you. Oh, and here's something just because she's up here and I don't, I haven't shown her in any of my videos and she's cute. This is my kitten, Lily, who's very, very hungry and wants food. <laughs> um, that's who I'm getting on to. Okay, well, I'm going to go. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I enjoyed showing it, or showing my stuff to you. Bye!